Good morning, people. Uh, today, we have a lot to do today. We have to get our tree, and there's a few errands I have to run myself, and obviously the normal scripting, normal writing, some editing, and obviously homework. As a student, I have to do homework. But um, I'm taking advantage of this wonderful sunny morning before it goes back to the rain. I love the rain. Sometimes it's nice to have the sun peeking out through the clouds. That's what we're gonna do this morning. I'm heading out just to have a little short, little tiny breakfast before we actually head out to grab our Christmas tree, which is gonna be an ordeal in itself. And I'm just gonna be filming all today. You guys keep requesting these vlogs. I don't know why, but it's something that through the past few times that I've done it, I've absolutely enjoyed, you know, getting more film experience in general. So this is something that I definitely do want to do more often after I've been doing it for the past two days. I'm gonna go eat because I am literally starving. So this is literally December in California. It's literally sunny and nice and it rains sometimes but also it just does this kind of nice thing, which is nice sometimes, it is. But um, yeah, like I said, very busy day ahead of us. But also, I have some stuff, just, you know, sit down. One thing that I definitely have realized is something that I wanna start doing more often is just sitting outside and eating and just kind of like having a talk with myself before the day. It's obviously not possible on every type of day, but it is something that I definitely have enjoyed in the past. I can't explain to you how gorgeous it is out here today. It sounds so cheesy, but um, I don't know. Today's just really nice. I feel really good today. Uh, I was definitely really productive yesterday, got a ton of stuff done. Today, obviously, I have a lot of my at-home stuff to do, a lot of errands that are gonna be out of the house, so yeah. What you doing? Are you a spy, Max? Spy, yes. Yeah. Is that like one yeah, of those, like, is that like the typer, like, geek type or whatever? Huh. I have my rainy day converse on because we're about to find a tree in the mud and that's gonna be interesting and it's gonna be fun, so. Was closed so now we have to go another way we're trying but we're trying again 39 minutes is that bad so we how do you get views and debbie Calming, acting stupid these are Making valuable youtube lessons <laughs> forget listening to like you know important people listen to her it okay well okay so after literally an hour and a half of trying to get here we're here we're looking we had a rough start to finding this tree it there was the roadblock and then all of a sudden like we couldn't find it but now we're here and we're trying to find a tree still it's too small good <laughs> Tree. Sounds like Max is a little biased. Is this it? Yeah. I am so happy to be able to say that we have found our perfect Christmas tree. Regardless of its little imperfections, we found it. We found our Christmas tree, and that is the first thing that really I had to do today. It was that Christmas tree. And we found it, and I'm just feeling really happy right now. And I'm just, I'm just feeling, I'm feeling some type of way right now. I'm, I feel like I could just sit here forever and just be happy. And it's like, 
really it's not the Christmas tree and really it's not that it's the holidays or that I have certain things it's just that like I'm content and I'm happy with the way that everything is going and the way that I am and I'm just I just feel really grateful right now I'm feeling I am feeling very 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 grateful not just for the tree just for life in general and it's just I'm so so glad to be here you know all too often I feel like I'm always like cuz I want stuff and you know like as a person who creates and as a person who is on YouTube I'm always wishing for like you know I want to get better so I'm always working hard on getting better and I'm you know there's always those next number milestones that are really important to me but also I just want to make sure that I stay in this state of being content and being happy being able to be happy in this moment I'm just feeling I'm feeling some type of way about it so So basically, in conclusion, I am just, I'm feeling very, very happy, but um, also there is a bunch of stuff I have to do. I just found this like sort of balance, something I never thought I would find, honestly. And that balance allows me to do stuff like this, like sitting down, having fun, you know, and finding the perfect Christmas tree. So this was our tree after we cut it down. Got this little stump going on right here. And now we're trying to load it onto the car. We're trying to get a 12 foot kind of tree onto the car, but I believe in us. We've, I think we're doing it. We've got it. a little update it is later there's just been a lot has been going on and now we're driving to the mall because I have to get something for school the mall closes in legit half an hour so that's great timing but today it's just been kind of like a lot to do and I still have to when I get home I still have to do obviously my homework and hopefully I can finish a script that would be nice but that's that's what's going on right now But yeah, that was a very successful shopping trip. Got some stuff, got some food. Today's just, in general, was a lot of like errand type things. So got the Christmas tree. That was an entire ordeal. An hour and a half both ways. Oh my God, that's crazy. We don't usually drive an hour and a half to get a Christmas tree. It's just that like the road was blocked. We had to go all the way around and then all the way around back. And now we are coming back from the mall, which was literally on the other side, like just very far away from where we went to get the Christmas tree, but I needed to get this stuff for school. And yeah, then I'm gonna get home, and like I said, I have uh, homework to do, scripts to do, and then maybe I, I definitely have a lot of editing to do. So homework, scripts, edit, and hopefully- Ice cream. Oh yes, we're gonna get ice cream. <laughs> and now oh, my camera died. Oh, there it is. Change battery pack, sad. But we stopped to get ice cream, which I think is what exactly I was talking about. That was a quick mission. We got myself some ice cream because I love ice cream. Now to get to work. All right, 
boy do I have a fun haul for you guys. Super short, but I think the most important thing I got today is this guy. It's just a MacBook Air. The last thing I can probably do on this is edit, but it is going to be important for some maybe some on the go stuff, but most importantly, school. And something that I think is just hilarious. I got an ugly Christmas sweater from the store that we used to all shop at as kids. And it has a llama on it. Yeah, we needed an ugly Christmas sweater. So I was like, what place do I know that has the most sparkles? And I was like, yes, the store I went to when I was like eight. This is the store. I only got two things, but it just felt like a lot. I would be like Casey Neistat and be like, yeah, I'm gonna drop a full comprehensive review, but I'm not very good at tech. I primarily edit on my iMac and that's something I could talk about, but, um, but I actually have a lot to do right now. I know I keep saying that and it's just been an insanely busy day. I've been out almost 12 hours now, so that's, crazy, but um, I do have to do a lot of stuff. Today was one of those days where I had a lot to do and I'm sitting down right now and I'm realizing, oh wow, I actually got a lot done because it felt like I didn't get a lot done and then I looked back at my completed to-do list and I was like, wow, like I actually did get a lot done. And it was one of those days where I was just out, outside, I was just out in the car with my family. I wasn't doing anything remotely different or big. It was just kind of one of those days where I realized like, hey, as cheesy and as dumb as it sounds, like, hey, I am so happy and so content. One quote that I absolutely adore right now is collect moments, not things. And that's something that I always claim to live my life by, but something I never really did. I'm not going to come out here and say that there aren't things that I want because there always are. Just kind of when you realize like every hour of your day is well spent and every hour of your day wasn't just sitting inside doing nothing. You're collecting these special moments, whether they be hanging out with your family in the car, rocking out to holiday music, or shopping at your old favorite store, cutting down the perfect tree, regardless of its imperfections, or sitting down in the middle of nowhere and realizing, hey, I'm kind of happy. And as cheesy as it sounds, these little things are literally what make me happy. 